folks, this match is underway. Radical versus Quoth Gaming here on Summit. This is the uh, NSL EU Division II semifinal matchup. We're seeing Radical starting up in Atrium doing a two, uh, actually, what, <laughs> two, two, what the heck? Um, sorry, it seems like they changed their mind and they are splitting one into crevice, uh, two going reactor core and two already pushing crossroads. Uh, while well, Commander Nexon, the new one, is building in an atrium. We got aliens, of course, uh, cross spawn in a sub access. Uh, they took ventilation and computer lab. While seems like uh, Ultimate is uh, or Alti trying to gorge up computer lab. Yeah, and we're seeing uh, these two. We got Alan and Draco just finishing up there in reactor core. Steamy Taco right on the outside. Looks like he's going to get tagged just a bit. And being known there, he's going to be backed up a little bit by Relent as he goes into Pipe Junction. Psycho and Flex in Crossroads. Sammy G seeing that they just got put that up. I like the spread here that Radical's doing. We see the Sys Chain moving from uh, into Computer Lab and into Ventilation where Dangio is there clogging that up. Uh, Ulte is checking up on Flight Control. Uh, this is kind of like a nice cutting of your part of the map. Uh, you know, you... Aliens are fine on three resource towers, but they might want to get a data core. That's why you see two skulls there, but I'm not sure if that's going to be enough. We got Al and Draco, uh, maybe Flex and Psycho are coming along. Or no, they're actually coming into ventilation. Psycho and Flex moving into ventilation. Danjo's in trouble. Gorge down, and they're going to move back and start sniping down that harvester. One oh, hydra in there is not bad. enough. We got three scouts around there, but that Harris is probably gonna go down. Couple more shots. No! <laughs> Harris just survives. <laughs> now they need a gorge there, and that gorge needs to get there quickly. But we got power almost up in data core. Data core. The Alan just died there, and those three scouts probably can roam down to the glass hallway. While uh, we see some rest biting in a crossroads. See and. Them. Yeah, Q motion. I there. see a Craig Hive uh, on the way. Always we got, nice. We got the Sys Chain moving into flight control. Relent just taking down Lev Steel. 88% built on that RT. That's going to end up being recycled. 20% on the RT in Crossroads. That's going to end up going down. Here comes a push from Radical, Alan, Draco, and Flex coming into Data Core with Ulti on the roof, seeing these guys pass by. 90%, 100% built on that power, and Ulti's gonna make his they move. They are so much split. Nice attack from behind. One Marine goes down. That resource tower eventually went down in ventilation. Uh, sniped from the five junction by Flex. Psycho moving into Crossroads right now on the other side of the map. We got Summit Reception, Lev Steel moving into flight control, which is a little bit sisted there. And Alan and Flex coming down the ramp in data core, leaving Sammy G just there on the in in the vents on the ceiling. He does take a pounce. Nice on Draco. All right. He does a parasite pounce. Look at that uh, resource tower in ventilation. Those Marines going to get a couple more shots in there. Seems like not, but still. Even if it grows, it's gonna be about halfway down on health, and that's not really what you wanna see from your resource towers. Seeing Sammy G doing some RT harassing in Data Core. Meanwhile, Lev Steel and Psycho sniping down that harvester in Computer Lab. Here comes Q Motion and Ulti taking down Psycho. Lev Steel is the only one left. He does end up victorious <laughs> on that fight. Nice shooting from his pistol. And Radical, two Marines moving into Data Core against Sammy G and Relent. Alright, so looks like that both teams uh, chose to go armor first, that's a carapace for aliens. We got armor one done for marines and they will now try to get a weapons one. So you will see a quite somewhat fast uh, upgrade. And no special strategy chosen by marines yet. This is uh, kind of going around the map, capping and trying to pressure your population and pump people up like what you would expect. Uh, so far, aliens are doing pretty fine job on the respiting. It's not exactly what they would love to see. But if I check on the resources, we got four resource towers for marines, uh, fifth one building, and three resource towers for aliens. With uh, team resources, 
Aliens are not that behind uh, from the Marines. Yeah, you know what? I'm I'm seeing a like kind of but a this... light offensive, you know, coming from yeah. kind of both teams. No, there's no like kind of all-in pushes yet. They're kind of just trying to, you know, five minutes into this game, trying to establish and hold a little bit of the control that they have on the map. We see Flex and Left Steel in flight control that just took out the Harvester there. They're just going to be cleaning up there, and two of Radical Marines in Data Core. I think Quoth needs to start making a move and start gaining a little bit more. Uh, um, actually got uh, ulti as a uh, lurk, but he has to get out of there because Psycho is uh, snipe, trying to snipe him with a pistol. So now we get one hard life form, but right on the other side, when this uh, fight finished, uh, Alan and Draco took down the resource tower in ventilation, and that's not good. I mean, the we see really nice pressure from the Marines, but they are not capping enough behind it, but still. Draco and Alan in pipe junction, just firing some bullets down into ventilation after they took down that harvester over in Crevice and Summit. We got Lev Steel and Flex moving in through Summit Reception into Flight Control. Looks like they're going to try to take that down as well. Wow. And those aliens were victorious there in ventilation, and they're going to move into Data Core and start pressuring that RT. Yeah, but they cannot allow uh, those Marines to take down the flight, but it's too late. That's going to go down. And it's gonna put aliens back on uh, two resource towers with a third one building in crossroads. What's up with that? You get two marines uh, pushing towards computer lab. You get two marines in the attack They might kind of rotate down to the crossroads. The one in computer lab was finished. So now, wow, this isn't good for aliens. Oh, let me check the resources. Yeah, it seems like those resources are opening up. Uh, so far it's 250 resources for marines, about 150 for aliens. We got Relent and in Atria biting down, biting down the upgrades. Oh, but next it jumps out. Him. And in meantime we got Psycho Flex and Lester from Radical taking down that harvester in Crossroads. So what's up with that? Three new harvesters being dropped in ventilation. Immediately being contested by Draco and Alan, the one in computer lab, and then there is a third one in flight. Oh, control. they ended up taking down the upgrades in Atrium. Sam G now working Whoa. on the IP in Atrium <laughs> as well, and he's just going to back off. So there is no upgrades for Radical right now. Great kind of move as they're focusing down, but I I don't know. It could be, it could just be that that is obviously just going to delay. Um, yeah, it's a temporary. Uh, it's a temporary at best, and. Uh, you know, Marines got 17 resources, and they are already, uh, they already dropped uh, that arm slap again, so they are fine. And uh, it will be beat up really soon, and those aliens didn't really utilize it. They might have killed a couple of Marines during the time, but now if... This is a small fight well, with shotguns junction, out it's... right now. We got weapons one, armor one, Q motion in crevice just underneath the catwalk there. Lev Steel backed up by Flex as he builds up that RT, and we're seeing some alien push on the other side of the map in Data Core. Seeing that Lurk as Ulti and Steamy Taco moving in there, attacking that RT as well. Quoth Gaming needs to establish definitely some control in this map. It looks like they're going into yep. flight control. They have two crags down that are built, but Flex and Lev Steel are there. I don't know if they're going to be able to hold this, Vin. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking, you know, that that Lark is doing the offensive job. He's not supposed to. He's supposed to be defensive. If you get Marines attacking your resource tower, you should be there. And it's not too late. That resource tower went down. Lark is uh, ultimate weapon in oh. holding down Marines in corridors. Nice it's... shot. I mean, the, the radical Marines with these shotguns in their hands are really deadly. Yeah, look at the ventilation. I mean, we got two Marines kind of trapped between a Lark and a Scout in... Uh, compute plot and uh, flight control, but there's three marines just took down another resource tower in ventilation and they are gonna pressure, they are gonna go for it they are moving into sub access now well while all this was happening we do see the upgrades have been lost again oh, again <laughs> <laughs> and uh, these three marines are moving into sub access Psycho, Draco and Allen in the main base of Quoth if they don't get pushed out this game is gonna be over pretty soon yeah, that that Lark uh, ult is really down on the health. He was able to get behind the hive, so he might be fine for now. Oh no, 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 he's almost down! What is he doing? <laughs> he needs to hide there.
Hold 29% on that. Here comes the spawn wave from Quoth. It looks like, yeah, Draco and Alan are going to have to retreat right now. While that was yeah, happening, can... though, Flex and Levsteel on the other side of the map were just pushing in. Nice yeah. little two-prong attack here and from Radical. And Draco and Alan are breaking away into ventilation where there is another new RT drop. They can just take it down if they want to. <laughs> oh, what timing. <laughs> they, I think this is a kind of block. I think at least three resource towers dropped in a really bad time by uh, Dungeo, the Dungeo. I mean, it's kind of unfortunate. I still can count at least three resource towers being his fault. Well, Draco and Alan ended up taking that down. They're still um, quoth around the map trying to you know get a little bit of progress in but you know what there goes another psycho just completely takes down relent in crossroads with that shotgun really good shot there weapons two is going up and yeah, that's nice uh aliens uh the commander dropped three cracks in the flight control so that's gonna be 99 percent the position for a second hive if no one from miracle is gonna take those down so we see Flex coming in there, he just sees that and he knows what's going on. But aliens don't have the resources to board up a second hive, they got 15, 16 resources now. They need 40 uh, yeah. and they are on two, might be three resource towers soon, but still that's like a long time away. Carapace shell has just been taken out a little bit ago in sub-access by two marines, they got cleaned up right after they took it out and we got flex and flight control trying to take down these crags, they are not gonna have enough to drop um, you know, to drop this you know, I'm gonna give you advice guys if you are dropping anything, just save your resources wait to drop it just before you drop that hive you don't, you don't need to have those crags there for any reason, if you are not defending there if you are not making it like a forward base there since no one was defending those cracks, they will just die to one marine and it's a sad loss of six resources. We got all of Quoth now coming in, about four of them. Um, so most yeah, of about them one in minute light. Control. Yep, and they <laughs> take that out. Crags are already gone and it looks like this pack is going to go through Summit Reception. We got one of them, uh, Relent in Crossroads, fighting Draco, doing a little bit of cat and mouse. He's going to be backed up by Ulti and backed up by Sammy G and Steamy Taco. Draco. Um, is gonna be a little bit in trouble here. He's got four skulks after him. Wow, <laughs> nice shot! Taking at least one of them. Look at this, Marines actually taking ventilation for themselves. They are not scared of that position. Uh, really nice thing. And they are, they just completed the phase gates and we will see a phase gate really shortly here in ventilation. I'm completely sure of that. Uh, because where do you want to put it? You want to put it in a big pressure point and Ventilation is the thing. Right, beacon. Yep. Wow, There's we got beacon. So they forced a beacon by running three skulls into Atrium. Stop their movement a little bit, giving both a little bit of a breather. Relent almost gets taken out um, by a mining <laughs> crevice. Uh, ends up getting taken out by a mine around the RT. And so Sammy G goes down as well. Here comes four of Marine, four of Radical Marines coming in through Summit Reception. And right, but... it looks like. Yeah, I mean, they're trying to establish some sort of control here, but it, it just can't. Radical is all over the place. Yeah, let's see what Q-Motion can do with his fate. We got the one fate in the field. Uh, if he's any good, uh, he can try to... What the f... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Alright, I take this completely back. Q-Motion couldn't hold his fate against uh, pistols from really far when he was trying to back off and now we see actually the uh, phase gate uh, being put up in flight control which is kind of interesting they could end this do another fades uh, right in now. here yeah we got Sammy G and Relent as fades now coming in um, against weapons 2, shotgun, armor 1, marines they do clean up those marines that were in flight control and now they are on that phase gate on the other side Psycho! Wow! Close, those phase gotta get out of there. Psycho and Flex came around the corner and started shooting down. More Marines pouring through the phase gate. <laughs> they didn't even take Flex and Psycho down. They are still in there and those fates are badly hurt. They need wow. to get home. Uh, Steamy Taco doing gate. a little bit of RT harassing in... Our, in uh, yeah, and there's the phase gate in ventilation. Uh, Alan is putting it up. Uh, 
the phase gate is being repaired in uh, flight control, but those are two phase, that phase gate is not up, it's almost up, 98% build. If he would just, uh, you know, disregard the fades and keep building it, they could have you know, put it up. You know, if, of this course... was, if this was Godar, um, you know, playing aliens, this is usually yeah. where um, Godar turns it around. I've always seen it, like right when they hit the fade plosion. Um, Godar always seems to turn it around, so I don't know if Quoth actually has, you know, the skill to, to do the same thing, but they may. We see Data Core has been dropped. They um, may, but... Yeah, but uh, we still get the weapons too, and uh, armor too, and uh, that's not that hard to deal with those fate. No, it's armor to start it. I might have uh, armor mislooked there. Alright, sorry there. Alright, Lev's still so you now said... coming in to sub access. He's gonna get completely annihilated here. <laughs> By those two fades. <laughs> right, two Marines pushing into data card. They're gonna see that hive in there. Uh... Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Ulti's like, no! <laughs> Alright, now two yeah, we, fades. We've got Gorge cord. there and two fades. Yeah, That's gonna be. That, it should be fine. It should be fine. Oh man. But those Marines oh, aren't dying! Man. What a mad spam! Fade almost I gone! Relent almost got lost! Oh! What? Wow! <laughs> Look at this engagement, guys! I mean, Radical is just... They're beasts! Wow, what an wow. individual play! And Commander, that, that mad spamming was spot on. He, from those like 20 mad packs he dropped there, he might have missed one. Awesome thing there. Very good job. These two, Psycho and Allen, are going to be joined by Flex and Datacore. Oh my god, Relent needs to be careful! Oh, <laughs> oh no! Alright, so we are down to one fate. Why and, uh... would you shadow step into three Marines with shotguns? Why would you do that? <laughs> Oh, the fate, oh, Data Core goes down. That's a huge hit. We're seeing a little bit of a counter push in Atrium. Sammy and Ulti in there, causing all sorts of havoc. Here comes the beacon. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. I, I, I saw him streaming in there, like Shadow stepping as I paid. And I was like, what are you doing? It was like slow mo, like, no. <laughs> Alright, so it looks like they've established, I mean, uh, Radical has established command and control of, obviously, uh, Atrium and Flight Control and, um, and Reactor Force. So Alright, Samichi good. might die in here. He's getting, oh, no. he's being enclosed in, a uh, here in a Reactor Core. If you got any Marines up, oh, yeah, no. Nexon is trying to take him down in Atrium. Oh, gosh. There's Left Steel coming there! He might go down! One more shot! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Do you see? He oh, pick a worst way what? ever! To oh get out boy. of the glass hallway. Know, what like, was? I'm at half health. About? Let me run through the marine base. <laughs> <laughs> and it was like there was a marine in the base. He gets away from it, and then a marine coming in from Kremis. Like, oh my god, Harvester uh, nice, going down. Nice trip there. Psycho and Flex. Yeah, they were probably communicating that easy, you know. Yeah, like, of course, of course. Coming through, and and they just really just blocked him. Oh boy, <laughs> that was a fade plosion the other way. That was. All right. <laughs> I have, I have no idea. I mean, I have kind of pretty idea where this match might go, but the aliens are actually pretty nicely keeping up on those resources. They are about 200 resources behind the marines, while the marines have 700 resources collected. Uh, the resource tower uh, count is kind of equal, or was equal seconds ago, and you know those marine those aliens are not doing that bad. They are losing life forms. But as far as the economy goes, they can kind of throw them uh, into the Marines' face. But those Marines are trying to pressure back now. I mean, yeah, we got it's Psycho getting and, crazy. And Flex just took out Carapace Shell in yeah. sub access. And they are taking out eggs like crazy. It, now, two in crossroads of the what, as well. So, double push here. Um, Quoth does not have the life forms to deal with this. No, they got one more. That's a second hive they lost. Yeah. Uh, with uh, those 60 resources lost in flight control for those cracks, I think even though they are doing fine job uh, with having a resource towers up, it's not enough. They just lost too much. They haven't lost the rest game. They kind of lost, uh, you know, the, the meta game, the strategy game. 
They, yeah, and they also, I mean, if you look at it too, I mean, they were losing in more engagements. There. I mean, when they lost all those life forms, I mean, it was yeah. just rough. I mean, you're seeing, oh, there goes the lurk, and this is it. It's over, guys. Oh my <laughs> gosh, really? <laughs> really? <laughs> uh, those Marines will just uh, take probably computer lab. There is a new RT being grown in ventilation. You know, it's semi finals. What is not gonna go? out of this game without the fight, you know. I think we might see a last high fall before we see Marines win this game. Still, there might be a GG. Uh, they got 25 resources. I'm looking what they can do with this. They don't even, I mean, look at their P res. I mean, they, they barely have anything. Look at all these engagements yeah. that they're losing. I mean, well, the, yeah, uh, hold on. I see. Steamy Taco. Steamy Taco got 68 uh, resources. They are waiting for uh, owners. They will go gorge, well. and they will go. They will go gorges. And I'm almost thinking like a gorge rush with uh, backed up with uh, one uh, one owners. That is gonna take a billion years with, with one harvester <laughs> to get seven resources for that auto. Yeah, I mean, they have got to be. They great might have right counted now. it on it a couple of minutes ago, but now we've got four marines in sub access, and oh boy, this is probably is. not gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, this is it, guys. I mean, Sammy G is going down. Psycho is in there. There yep. we go. Good there game call. And well the hive goes down, and we see Marines win. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Marines won that one. Did you guys catch that? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that was round one, guys.